the person I hate the most is Dwayne Johnson, board of directors of the WWE and TKO. That's who I am angry at right now because I am looking at the board of director that came in, used his power to take this opportunity away from Cody and put himself in the main event at WrestleMania 40. That's how I look at it right now. So you see, this is the level of absurdity and bullshit that The Rock has got to deal with. The Rock doesn't know who that guy is, but he knows what he is, and that's a goof, an idiot, another pro wrestling Cody crybaby jack off idiot who wow. thinks he knows everything but doesn't know shit. The guy is sitting in his basement with a bathrobe and a Cody Rhodes t-shirt on. And he's talking about how much he hates The Rock. You don't give that guy a podcast, you give him a straight jacket. How much he hates The Rock. I just, you hate The Rock, you hate The Rock. <laughs> <laughs> it has nothing to do with the board. The Rock will get to that in a second. It has everything to do with common sense, you idiot, you goof, and to all the Cody crybabies who are grown-ass men who think you know it all when you don't know shit. You listen up to The Rock right now. It has nothing to do with the board. It has nothing to do with the fact that The Rock owns everything as it relates to The Rock, the people's champion, full ownership, which means The Rock is the boss. It has nothing to do with that. It has to do with common sense. Just finished my show, Busted Open, on a Friday afternoon. Here I am, and what do I got to talk about? I'm not relaxing with my wife on my house on the biggest mountain in Vernon, New Jersey. What do I have to deal with? I have to deal with all the, the messages, the texts, the tweets about you, Rock, calling me out on social media, on Instagram, on Twitter, <laughs> whatever it is. Yeah, it was hard. Let me tell you something, Rock, okay? All due respect, because I do respect you. I grew up watching Polynesian Pacific Championship Wrestling on the financial network here in New Jersey, okay? So all respect. But one thing that I don't appreciate is how you label me and label the fans of Cody Rhodes. You want to know something? I love the fact that we now have a rallying cry. Cody crybaby. That's right. I'm a Cody crybaby, <laughs> and I'm damn proud of it. I wear it. I wear Cody Rhodes because I'm a fan. Listen, you know about fandom. You're always throwing up the U. You throw up the U all the time. Miami Hurricanes. Why is it okay for you to be an uber fan, but we can't be? Why? Because it doesn't fit your narrative? And I love the fact that you said, hey, I'm a board member of the TKO. This has nothing to do with that. But then you call yourself the boss. The boss. What do bosses do? They squash the common man. They squash the working man. I Dare I say, try to break the American dream. How about that? I am a Cody fan, and I'm going to watch Cody Rhodes win that undisputed WWE Universal Championship at WrestleMania 40. I've lost a lot of respect for you, Rock. And if you watch that clip, and you're right, I'm disheveled. I got the bathrobe on. My hair's a mess. Because that was immediately after <laughs> what you did to Cody on SmackDown that Friday night. Who was I doing Busted Open with? And by the way, it's not a podcast that I do in my mom's basement. I'm a grown man. Or I'm a married man. I have a family. I'm a family man. And I'm doing that show with two WWE all Famers. Maybe you didn't look at the video. Maybe there's something wrong with your eyes. Maybe you don't see clearly. But I did that show with Bully Ray, WWE Hall of Famer. I don't know. Maybe you heard of the most decorated tag team of all time, the Dudleys. And I did that with Mark Henry, World's Strongest Man, WWE Hall of Famer. Maybe you seem to forget the people that helped you along the way. But those are the men that I do this show with. So maybe you need to listen. Maybe you need to give some respect on my name because of the people who I work with. And I have, I'm giving you an open invitation anytime to come on Busted Open. You know why? Because we're live seven days a week on Sirius XM, major <laughs> platform. And we do have a podcast as well. So, you know, you're welcome to come on any day, seven days a week. With some of the legends in this business. Blood, sweat, and tears, my friend. But I will be at WrestleMania 40. And I will be watching Cody Rhodes beating Roman Reigns. 
the head of the table to become the undisputed WWE Universal Champion. You had your time, and it was great. You had your time, but it's time for somebody new, and that man's name is Cody Rhodes. And I'm going to watch him finish the story. And I love, I love that I've gotten under your skin enough <laughs> that you did an Instagram post about it. <laughs> An Instagram post. I'm a Cody crybaby. i damn proud. It's called fandom. It's called passion. It's called love. It's not using your platform as a member and a board member of TKO it's to fired up, completely man. change the landscape and the story that we've been following. I'd love to have a conversation with you. I would love it. I would love open forum. Busted open live seven days a week. You pick the day. You pick the time. I'll be there. And I will be in Philadelphia to watch my guy Cody Rhodes beat Roman Reigns in the main event of night number two. A main event that the fans didn't want you in. Didn't want you. That's why you're getting a response from everybody. That's why every arena is selling out. Not to cheer you or to see you in the main event. But to boo you and watch the guy that they're behind, Cody Rhodes, in the main event at WrestleMania 40. So remember the guys. Remember the Dudleys. Remember Mark Henry. Those are the guys I do the show with. They were in the video. Did you, did you forget about Mark Henry? Did you forget about the car lines? Mark hasn't. So come on our show. Be a part of Busted Open. I would love it. Call me out in front of my face. Say what you said in the He's video in front of my face. He's ready to fight somebody. You have a boil? <laughs> then do it. <laughs> Fucking tired of this shit. <laughs> Fucking trashing on fans now? Is that what you've lowered yourself to? The trashing on fans? <laughs> I'd love the opportunity to talk to you. <laughs> oh, wow. <sighs> Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching.